We can create links and relations between modules. To do so we use the record selector field. So, let's see how the record selector behaves. Starting from the namespace list, we select the namespace in which we want to create a link between modules. Then, let's click on our My Item module to add this link. For example, we want the name of the suppliers for our items, which we can find in the account module. Let's start by adding a new field. In name we enter account ID. For a record field, it's good practice to use the name of the module we want to link to, followed by ID. In title we enter account. Then, we go on and we choose record selector. Click on the wrench icon. And then on the record tab to set to which module we want to link. We want to link to an account, so we select account. We select account name as record label from field, which is the value that will be displayed for this field in the user interface. Then you can also set which field you want, in order to enable field search. In our case, of course we want to use account name. You can add filters as well, but we won't need this feature now. Then, let's have a look at the general tab. The most important option to mention here is multi-value. With multi-value unchecked, like now, our relationship allows one my item record to be linked to only one account, yet an account can have multiple my item records. This is called a one-to-many relationship. However, when we select multi-value we allow a my item record to be linked to many accounts. Also in this case an account can have multiple my item records. This is a many-to-many -many relationship. We save and close to confirm. To finish let's click save and close. 